we have returned to black and white because because of that oh, that shit that's how I feel black and white and gloomy such bad bad weather school's closed today because of the cold the high is supposed to be zero the high tomorrow is supposed to be minus three wind chill advisory until sunday i don't know what it is uh where jason is right now in new york city but i know it's shit i know he must fucking hate new york like i told him yesterday new york state sucks uh back to uh video fights after a uh two-week hiatus kind of uh wish we did follow through with our uh, plans last week but you knew something was gonna get pushed away just because that's the way it goes when you got so many people and trying to do things but uh jason gave us alanis <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Okay, Alanis Morissette versus um, Foo Fighters. I've never seen that Foo Fighters video. If I did, maybe parts of it. Alanis Morissette video in 1997, that seemed like it was on all the time. And it also seemed like it was this time of year. That video is depressing just because of the weather. All the snow and the shit and the cold looking roads. Uh, we'll start with that video. She seemed annoying to me now that's 20 years later and she's, I don't know, she must have been probably early 20s. I think that whole age, that early to mid-20s age to me now, they're annoying people usually. So it seemed kind of annoying. It was a good concept. I liked it. Like, um, you know, entertaining herself on a, on a uh, well, it just seemed like it was supposed to be a long trip, but uh, it seems like she ran out of gas at the end. I don't think I ever put that together 20 years ago. That she ran out of gas. Uh, but again, interesting concept. Uh, the the girl in the green, the Atlantis in the green, with the with the uh, retarded, the crippled kind of um, movements was weird. And I'm trying to wonder if I think she was pretty. I think I think one of my Don or Jason or both that back in her heyday thought she was pretty hot. Uh, I didn't see it. She is cute, but that's about it. And she does have a good voice, and I wonder what happened to her. Anyways, uh, the video was good. Pretty good. Not great, but original. <clears throat> and, um, the song itself, with the lyrics, I like that a lot. Um, makes you think about some things. So, uh, that's my take on that video. The Foo Fighters video. Uh, I know that Jim and Don are just huge Foo Fighter fans, and I can guarantee you that Jim's picking Foo Fighters, which is, I got a, I got some Foo Fighters in my pocket, but I'm hesitant to use it because I feel like no matter what it is, like I know who's going to pick it. So I try to get videos that are, um, that are going to be, you know, um, hard for you guys to pick. But, uh, yeah, the, uh, what's his name? Dave Grohl. Great voice. Very good song. The video to me was um, okay. Uh, I, I found it interesting that, that when he saved um, the baby and the dog, there was like no reaction. But when he saved the picture of, that was his wife, right? Or girlfriend. Like that's when he got all the accolades and the congratulatory pats on the back. Uh, and why was the dog and the baby's face blacked out with the black uh, stripe? Wonder about that. That was weird. I don't get it. There's been many babies in videos and many dogs. So I'm kind of curious on what you guys think about that. So, uh, uh, again, Foo Fighters are great. Uh, Lannis Morissette, very talented. Man, this, this, is, this is pretty close right here. I haven't made a, a choice yet. But I think I'm going to go with Alanis Morissette because even though I have seen it a thousand times, it still was very original. Uh, you know, her starring in a video by herself, but with four different versions of her. Uh, so I'll go with that. And the songs are pretty much equal to me. Uh, the the There Goes My Hero. 
um, not to get too corny, but I remember Howard Stern and, and his crew talking about that song, about talking about their father, which made me think of dad. This was probably, I don't know, early 2000s, 03, 04 or something. And, you know, there goes my hero. He's ordinary. And then I start picturing dad just walking to the, to the station where I get every day at three o'clock with that. Remember that lunch pail he had that, that looked like a real lunch pail, but it was plastic. But I don't know. I just had that vision of, you know, of dad, you know, ordinary, but always working hard. So again, that's, that's kind of what I took from that. Uh, and I'm wondering what, uh, Foo Fighters were singing about. Were they singing about just ordinary people or was it something, uh, personal to them? Maybe their father or somebody close to them, but that's always kind of remind me of, and I do think of dad when I hear that song. So that's it on that. I'm picking a Lance Morris set because I think the video was better. And, uh, that's it. Uh, it was a good scene, everyone. Seemed like, uh, it was fast, you know? It was quick. Now here we are back to the shitty grind with the shitty weather. It's going to be a long winter. I mean, it's January 4th or 5th. It's January 5th. And we got at least two more months of this shit. Man. All right, guys, have a good weekend. Enjoy. Uh, I don't know who's going to watch football playoffs, but they should be good. Uh, Jay, I hope you made it back safe. That I know you did. And Jim, uh, probably, I don't know when I'm going to see Jim. I'll never see Jim. So I'll talk to you guys uh, soon. Later.